Ephesians uh, 5.23, he declared that Jesus was the head of the church. Does he mean to, that Jesus is, the, is over or for? I believe the best way to define what he means in verse 23 is to drop down to verses 29 and 30. In 29 and 30, in relationship to the church, Jesus is the source of substance and strength. Uh, Paul declared that Jesus fed and cared for the body, which is the meaning uh, of for rather than over. In reality, Paul has a double metaphor for head. In respect to the universe, taking you back to 1 and 23, in respect to the universe and his enemies, he is the ruler. He is the authority, and he is the head. But it would seem that in the context of Ephesians chapter 5, in respect to the church, he is the sustainer. Check out the new series, Hymns of Hope, on Praise and Harmony TV today. In this six-part series, Jeff Walling takes us on a journey through studying the Psalms and how they integrate with our modern worship. Not about the songs that were written maybe in the last hundred years or even in the last thousand years. No, we're going to reach back more than 2,000 years to Israel's hymnal, their hymnal of hope. Enjoy timeless stories about how we got some of our most beloved songs. When finally the telegram came through, and it's a famous one, it just had two words on it. The words came from Horatio Spafford's wife. And the two words were, saved, alone. And sing along with the praise and harmony singers. Check out Hymns of Hope on Praise and Harmony TV today.